In this video, I'm gonna discuss the dreaded bow tie effect on an oval cut diamond and why you need to be aware of that when choosing an oval cut diamond. So keep watching. This is Vanessa from Vanessa Nicole where I create custom diamond rings for clients all over the world. And one of the things I wanna talk about today are oval cut diamonds and why you want to avoid that strongly exhibited shadow right in the center of the oval, which we call a bow tie effect. Most oval cuts will have some sort of bow tie effect in the center, but it's to what degree can you see it? How dark is that shadow? You wanna find one where it either blends in seamlessly with the color of the oval or, or you don't even notice it at all. The only way to notice the bow tie effect is through visual inspection. You can't just go based off one photo and you shouldn't just go based off of the grade report because that does not actually tell you how strong this effect is. So it's really important to visually inspect it yourself or have somebody like myself inspect it on your behalf so you find one that doesn't have that effect. So besides all the other things that you have to consider when choosing any diamond, such as cut and color and clarity and the size of it, you're going to have to also think about the bow tie effect when it comes to ovals, which a lot of people don't even think to look at. They're just looking at online prices and they think, oh, that one's really cheap, let's go with that one. But usually that means that there's a strongly uh, darkened effect for that bow tie. So that is definitely something that you need to consider. And I absolutely love sourcing beautiful oval cut diamonds for clients. So feel free to reach out to the studio. More than 70% of my clients are not local and I look forward to exceeding your expectations. Talk to you later, bye-bye.